Good afternoon, I'm Katie Wallace. Thanks for joining us. The University of Oregon's women basketball player Sabrina Ionoscu is the first player in the NCAA to record 2,000 points, 1,000 assists, and 1,000 rebounds. She also secured her 26th career triple-double. The achievement happened hours after Kobe Bryant's memorial service. Number three, Oregon jumped ahead of fourth-ranked Stanford this past week. Although the impact from the NFL Combine may not be known for a while, the players' breakout performances left their mark. Several draft picks were able to distinguish themselves from the rest, players like Jalen Hurts, Henry Ruggs, and Jerry Judy. However, standouts to a tug Tagovailoa, Joe Burrow, and J.K. Dobbins, who were pronounced to go early, did not participate in some events. Burrow did, did not throw during his workout, and Tagovailoa and J.K. Dobbins also chose not to work out. Deontay Wilder will probably need to make some adjustments ahead, ahead of his third fight with Tyson Fury. Last week, Wilder was left in his cor own corner battered, throwing in the towel in the seventh round to be defeated by the Gypsy King himself. Fury was crowned heavyweight champion of the world. Previously, Wilder and Fury had met for the first time in December of 2018, which had resulted in a draw. And finally, the World Health Organization prepares for, the, prepares for a pandemic and the sports world is already feeling the impact of the coronavirus. Fears are arising that the Tokyo 2020 Olympics will be impacted, but the International Olympic Council assured that the games would go ahead and they intend to host a safe and secure game. That's all for now. Have a great day.